I feel very confident. I have uh, felt, you know, we went in with a very big lead today. And it looks like uh, Republicans have shown up in force. This election should be over. They spend all this money on machines. And frankly, if they'd use paper ballots, it would be over by 10 o'clock. And by the way, the paper ballots would cost 8 percent. Would be 8 percent of the cost. If they would use paper ballots, voter ID, uh, proof of citizenship, and one day voting, it would all be over by 10 o'clock in the evening. It's crazy. Regrets. You always have regrets. I can't think of any, to be honest, to use her expression. I can't think of any. Um, I, I look, I ran a great campaign. I think it was maybe the best of the three. Uh, we did great in the first one. We did much better in the second one, but something happened. And uh, this was the best. I would say this was the best campaign we ran. On the assumption I win, I mean, I don't know if uh, something else happens. I don't know what's going to happen in terms of declaring victory, but... If in normal times I would go over to the convention center, let's say at 10 o'clock or 11 o'clock or something, but I just don't know. I don't have to tell them that. And they, I certainly don't want any violence, but I certainly don't have to tell. These are great people. These are people that believe in no violence. Unlike your question, you believe in violence. If I lose an election, if it's a fair election, I'm gonna, I'd be the first one to acknowledge it. Uh, and I think it's, well, so far, I think it's been fair. I think there's been a lot of court cases. Both sides are lawyered up. Thousands of lawyers are 